Hi, this is Connie. I am here with Bookcase Club, Bookcase.club unboxing. Now, as you can see, I've already opened this box, but I have not read anything about the books themselves. I have just opened it. I did get this box free of charge for my honest review. So there is my disclaimer. I um, also got, the, the thing that confuses me a little bit is I got two of these boxes. And I've written John about it, but have not yet heard anything. And on what he wants me to do about that, um, or whatever. So anyway, let's get to opening those, these boxes. First thing in here is the bookcase.club Happy Valentine's Day from the book, bookcase.club. Uh, be sure to tag us on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. Here is their information there if you want to go there. This is a book, this is a monthly subscription. It is $9.99 a month and you get two books. There are several different uh, genres that you can do and I forget to write those down every time. But um, there is like uh, contemporary romance. There's paranormal romance, which I like. There's mystery. There is, um, you get um, like four books a month if you do the kids' books where you can read read these books to your little ones. Um, I love this. I love, love, love this. Okay. So big things from bookcase.club. To celebrate our upcoming one-year anniversary, we are excited to announce the launch of the Mega Case. The Mega Case is our new monthly contest prize that will be sent to one lucky subscriber each month. The first mega case will be awarded in April to coincide with our first birthday. The contest starts March 1st and runs through March 30th. To enter the contest, all you need to do is two simple things. Be an active book bookcase.club member with your account in good standing. Leave us a review on CrateJoy.com. The more reviews we get, the more people will see us. We will be announcing the theme for our first mega case on March 1st, so keep an eye out on our pages. And then there's an also a referral program. In late January, we launched the bookcase.club referral program. For every five people that open an account, thanks to your referral emails or social media posts, you will get a free month of bookcase.club added to your subscription. Simply log into your bookcase.club account and look for refer more friends friends. Enter the email address of people you know will love bookcase.club and send them an email. You also have access to Facebook and Twitter links that will help get your friends into our bookcase.club. The problem is, is I cannot find that refer your friends link in my bookcase.club. So John, if you're seeing this, please help me out. All right. And it says, Connie, even though spring is still a month away, why not take time for yourself and relax? Enjoy your February picks and fall in love with reading again. Happy Valentine's Day, Katie. All right, so the first book I'm going to get out of here is The Ghost Bride by Yangtze Chu. Blessing or Curse. One evening, my father asked me whether I would like to become a ghost bride. Who asked? The Lim family. The Lim family was among the wealthiest households in our town of Malacca. They had a son who died a few months ago, a young man named Lim, Lim Tan Cheng. Do you remember him? Lim Tan Cheng was something, someone I had seen perhaps once or twice at some festival. Apart from the name of his wealthy clan, he had left no impression at all. Surely he was very young. Not much older than you, I believe. What did he die of? A fever, they say. In any case, he is the bridegroom. My father spoke carefully as though he was already regretting his words. And they want me to marry him? This practice of arranging a marriage of a dead person was uncommon, usually held in order to placate a spirit. The deceased concubine who had produced a son might be officially married to elevate her status to a wife 
or two lovers who died tragically might be united after death. That much I knew. But to marry the living to the dead was a rare and indeed dreadful occurrence. Yes, it is you that they want. Um, I don't know if this sounds very good to me. I don't know, but I will give it a shot. Let's see. This says, this says, uh, this book is a rare experience of total immersion in the exotic Chinese beliefs about the afterlife. We follow Li Lan into a bizarre world of ghosts, deities, demons, and human spirits wending their way towards reincarnation. Um, I will give it a shot. Let's put it that way. I, you know, it just doesn't sound like my cup of tea, but I'm going to try it. All right, the next book is by Katana Collins, and it's Soul Stripper. She'll take everything you have, it says. Now, this one looks better to me. Um, okay, from the back here, it says, It's called Sin City for a reason. Nowhere else in the are the temptations so great, the sex so good, and the demons so bad. By day, Monica is a barista in a local cafe. It doesn't pay a lot, but it puts her up close and personal with her sexy boss, Drew. Unfortunately, that's as far as a succubus can go unless she wants to take his soul. Monica needs mind-blowing sex to sustain her, and she finds her victims every night as lo at a local strip club where she's an exotic dancer. But when her powers begin to dim diminish and her fellow succubi start turning up dead, all bets are off. Monica realized she's the one immortal who has a chance in hell of making things right. Sexy, dark, and imaginative will leave readers on their knees begging for more. Here's another one. What a ride. I can't wait to see what happens next in this fantastic new series. Now this one sounds pretty good to me. I like succubi and that kind of stuff, so... It's called Sin City for a reason. Nowhere else are the temptations so great, the sex so good, and the demons so bad. A fallen angel turned succubus, Monica, finds her powers wanting, and mortality threatens to take hold. So these are my two books for the month. One awesome, one I don't know about. Um, let me know if you've read either one of these or if you're interested in reading either one of these. And... I will talk to you next month with my next bookcase.club, and I will leave all the links below. Bye-bye.